This is Indio Radio. You're listening to That MMA Show. I am here with J.J. Ambrose. J.J., didn't quite go your way this night. You know, we've documented everything on the show this week. Tell me a little bit about how did this crowd, the, the extreme noise that they had, affect your game plan? Oh, it was crazy. Uh, you know, uh, in the staging area, I was, you know, standing in front of the tunnel, and I see all these Dave Rickles heads. You know, they're just waving at me. I'm like, oh, no. And then, uh, you know, come out, music starts playing, and all of a sudden, I can't even hear my song. It's just booze. I'm like, oh, man. Never in my life, never in my career has I ever, have I ever been booed so bad. But, you know, my nerves kind of got me, and, uh, like, my cardio went out the window. I mean, I trained my ass off for this fight, but, like, literally, my nerves just played a huge part in this fight. It sucked, you know. The whole time, I was, like, on my back foot. I was never moving forward like I normally would. So I was, I was definitely rattled right out the gate. So, All right, well, what's next, JJ? Uh, I'm going to go to Vegas, actually, for a couple of days, hang out. Uh, then go home, see my family, then get back in the gym. I want to start lifting heavier and, you know, just get right back into it. Uh, I was obviously considering dropping a weight class, too. I, uh, I didn't even have to cut weight for this one. I woke up on weight, so maybe go down to featherweight, give, my, give uh, Pat Coran a shout-out. <laughs> nice. I like that right here on that MMA show in Full Contact Fighter TV. Pat Curran, he might be looking for you. All right, JJ, thanks. Yeah, thanks a lot. Thanks for having me. I appreciate it.